$1.3 billion. If you won the Powerball, what would I do? What would you do with $1.3 billion? I would invest a lot of it. In what? And I don't know. I would hire somebody I don't to know. invest it. <laughs> and then uh, you I have would, to be careful on who you hire because if you I have one point three, I know a couple of pretty trustworthy people. I wouldn't give them a hundred one point three billion. I'd just oh. give them a couple. Yeah. Hundred. Here's 000. a million here, a million there, whatever. Just a couple hundred thousand. Two hundred and fifty thousand yeah. right now in a CD invested into a CD brings out twenty thousand dollars a year. So. Yeah. <clears throat> Or twenty thousand dollars, no, something like I don't remember. Okay, so what something else like would that. you do? Um, I would pay off all of our debt. Oh gosh, that's not much. That's like a penny out of that. <laughs> yeah, that would be a penny out of that, but still. And then I think what I would do is I would buy one of those condos on that cruise ship. That oh yeah. That you can you can just build the condos on. Yeah, you live you on the fly, cruise ship. You can fly on and off the cruise ship whenever you want. Would you quit your job? Uh, yes. Yes. Probably. <laughs> Some people are like, no, I wouldn't quit my job. I would still work and have all that. I'm like, $1.3 billion. $1.3 billion. As I would long as, quit. As long as I was making enough money on my investments to make right around $20,000 a month, just coming in residually. Outside of your $1.3 out, billion? Outside of the $1.3 billion. If I invested what I could of the $1.3 billion into whatever to bring in $20,000 consecutively every month, yeah. I, I would quit my job. And yeah, that would be easy with 1.3. Here's the other thing. I, I if I had that much money, I would literally like put a couple million per kid in a oh, in an a, account. In an account, yeah. Yeah, and then we would have an apartment on a cruise ship. We would be selling the world. We'd have a cabin in Alaska. Yep, we'd, we'd have, have a, a location home in Florida. Yeah. Yep. I would not have a home in Canada though. No. Maybe a home in our, in uh, in Chile would be fun that would be sweet. right remember that pond that location that has like umpteen swimming pools do you oh, remember yeah, in Arica. yeah. That where be, that would be fun in Arica. Arica. Well, it's not umpteen swimming pool I don't know a, how many but it's, it's the along the beach right pool. yeah it's the largest uh, swimming pool in the world and it's yeah it's uh, yeah well, anyways, but the, the chances of us actually winning are like nothing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And here's the funny thing. Do you, have you ever won anything? What's your chances? Do you win stuff when you put in for stuff? I've won stuff every once in a while, yeah. I don't win stuff ever. My name is on something. Pretty much guarantee I don't win. So, like that whole, what's this, like the, the chances of someone, one person winning, pretty unlikely. But would you want to put in like, let's say we put in... 20 bucks. It can't be any worse than your fight or not fight, your uh, fantasy football. Right? Maybe. I don't know. See, that whole fantasy football thing, you could have just thrown all that in the garbage. Like 50 bucks down the toilet. Right? So I say we do 20 bucks. Let's hit up our friends in Idaho and say in fact I did. I, I did text my girlfriend and I was like Hey, if I gave you uh, this much money to get some Powerball, if I asked you to go buy us some Powerballs, I would give you a couple million out, out of that if we won. Would that be fair? <clears throat> that would save us, like, you know, because if we drive up there, that's 20. That's how much we could have spent on Powerball. Right? Yeah. See? That's good thinking right there. Anyways, I think we should, I think, and if... Can you imagine if that actually, if that, if we won, <laughs> the chances be, of that happening? That would be crazy. That would be so crazy weird. I'd be like, I never win anything. And then we, you know what else we would have to do? We'd totally have to get security guards. No, we wouldn't. Yeah, we would. No, if we someone wouldn't. finds out that we have one point have to get security billion, guards. Oh, come on. we'd have to get like bodyguards and no, stuff. No, we wouldn't. Yes, we would. And that would be cool. Do you think Channing Tatum would be my bodyguard? I wouldn't guard? want to hire a bodyguard. What about Matthew? Do you think Matthew would be willing to be my bodyguard? I'll be your bodyguard. Oh, well. Screw Matthew and Channing. <laughs> Peckers. <laughs> oh, come on. It's all fun and games. It's not like we'd really win. Have we really won, though? 
if I had that much, we could actually meet people that we never would have been able to meet. Can you remember the video on YouTube that I was watching about that guy? <laughs> oh, no, you weren't there. No, it probably wasn't there. Some guy. <laughs> what? Oh, just nice dropped drop. you. Sorry, you hit the bump. Some guy, uh, there was a, a newscaster that was asking all these questions at the at where people were picking up power balls and they're like do you know how much you could win and do you know what you would do with it and do you know all this and, and all that and in the and the one guy was like yeah i know how much i'll win and stuff like that and then he's like well what would you do with it and he was like i would uh he was like he was like uh cracking hookers <laughs> what? And the lady was like, oh, okay. Kraken uh. <laughs> hookers, what the heck? Weird. Kraken <clears throat> hookers. Would you get cracker hookers? No, I wouldn't get it. Sounds either. like crackers. I you would buy go, some crackers. You know the first thing I would do? I would, first thing I would do Bridger is get rid of get my hookers. crappy car. <laughs> first thing I would do is get rid of my crappy car and go out and buy me a Maserati. Oh, heck yeah. That would be fun. That's funny. So you'd get some crackers and Bridger would get hookers. Remember that vlog? Do you guys remember that vlog? Did you watch that vlog? Probably. Where Bridger says, go get your coat. It's, you know where the hookers are? The hookers. <laughs> nice. it's a funny vlog. Anyways, we are having a date day. We are going to Outback to use our gift card that we got for Christmas. Thanks, Mom. From our, from Jake's from, mom, from my mother-in-law. The most awesome mother-in-law on the planet. Anyways, so we're going to go use that today because today we both have the day off. What's the chances of that happening? Unless you're talking about my mother-in-law, then I have an awesome mother-in-law. Virginia. Well, okay. Anyways, we got 50 bucks for Outback with Jake's mom. So we're using that today. And Evie's getting you grooming. She's going to look so cute when she's done. Hopefully they actually we should have do done it right. the, the before and after of her. She oh, we like, should have done it before like and Chewbacca after. Actually, I think Chewbacca's I have relatives. videos. So I could pause it. Pause the video. Anyway. All right. So think about what would you guys spend your $1.3 billion on? Uh, I just, I do want to share on that on Facebook. Someone said... Uh, 1.3 billion dollars um, divided by 3 million Americans they would get 4.3 million each poverty that would solved. poverty solved I don't know would you be willing to donate that much yeah as long as would I got 4.3 million yeah but there's so many people out there that wouldn't take it that's true but some people would be like I'll take theirs and I'll be like, dude, I offered you one portion. Now, is that number, is that including newborn babies? Like, I don't know. Or is that just 18-year-olds? I don't know. And above. I don't know. Anyways, so how, what would you spend your $1.3 billion on? Comment down below. Let us know. I want to know what you would spend your $1.3 billion on. Would you donate? Would you, would you travel? What would you do with that much money? That is insane. I would love to win that. <laughs> I would donate to the, I think one other thing is, I would donate to the local hospitals that I have so they can upgrade a lot of their equipment to more standardized. Yeah, um, that'd be good. Technology mm -hmm. and stuff that's up to date and, and more thorough. That'd be awesome. Give to the local women's shelters. That'd be cool. Comment down below, guys. What about Give that? somebody the greatest secret Santa Claus. Oh my ever. gosh. I would do so much. Maybe 10, 15. And I wouldn't family. tell anybody it was me, but I'm sure they'd figure it out after so much was going on. <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be fun. So whoever won the thing, they're paying off people's debts and stuff. <laughs> anyway, comment down below. What would you do? 